I manifested up a wind today in like seven seconds. You're going to love this. And it just might inspire you to play a little bit differently. My name is Mr. 2020. I do want to thank you for listening. And I want to welcome you to the Neville Goddard Podcast. Coming to you live from Melbourne, Australia. It is 7.38 a.m. I should be getting ready for an appointment which canceled on me this morning. Oh my God, nobody ever cancels on me. I am nuts about that. But I got to tell you, like seriously, in, in like 10 years, I think I've had three cancellations right in the past 10 years since I've been here. So that tells you something. But here's what happened this morning. I got a cancellation. <laughs> oh boy. With a, hey, 20, I'm sorry, but I'm like, cool, no problem. Now here's the cool thing. Why did I get a cancellation? Why am I 100% cool with it? Because of this. Because of this stuff. Because of what I imagined before I got out of bed this morning. So this morning I was doing my Joseph Goddard's. I was putting 5 to 10, 6 to 12 buns in the oven stuff. And uh, something kept popping in. See, normally when I do my Joseph Goddard's, they're for about 70% of them are things that happen every day. The podcast, the pool, coaching calls, your emails, yummy lunch with Victoria, play with the puppies. You see, most people don't bother giving life to stuff like that. They assume it would have happened anyway. <laughs> right. Neville Goddard says, you bring something into being with your imaginal act. You sustain it with your imaginal act. And when the imaginal act is withdrawn, it vanishes. It's gone. See ya. Think about it. So, while I was doing my Joseph Goddard's, I kept having this niggling. Niggling, niggling, niggling. Now, here's what I imagined up. I imagined up doing a live call, USA Friday. I had something on my mind about the state akin to sleep. And uh, I'm nuts about it, by the way. I notice a lot of people miss a lot of stuff about the state akin to sleep. Or they think it is meditation. Or that you need brain waves to do it. Or that if you sit there and stare at a candle for four hours... Or, there's a lot of misconceptions about the state akin to sleep. Anyway, Neville said don't skip it. I say don't skip it and don't add to it. Please. But I appear to digress. So, let me back up. While I'm doing my Joseph Goddard, which is like 70% of the same stuff every day, 30% is unique, that's cool. I do my 5 to 10, my 6 to 12, my 7 to 11 wishes before I get out of bed in the morning. Before I go take a pee and drop the kids off at the pool. And here's what happens, gang. I keep getting this niggling idea. It keeps niggling at me, right? Let's do a live call, USA Friday, on the state of kind of sleep. I'm imagining doing the call. That's not part of the Joseph Goddard protocol. Joseph Goddard protocol is about today. But all right. So I get up, and I don't have the time, right? My schedule today, I do not have the time. To put together, to email out uh, all the materials that I need for a call on Friday. And today's the day that I do that. But I've imagined doing a call on USA Friday. Guess what happens? I get a cancellation this morning. I get that time. An hour appointment generally takes up an hour and a half of my time. So I've got 90 minutes. And I invest that 90 minutes. And now we're having a call USA Friday on the state of kind of sleep. And the mystical experience. Because the state of to sleep is, is, it's all about manifesting, and it's also all about the mystical. A lot of people try to figure out the mystical, <laughs> right? A lot of people try to force manifesting. That's right. Both of them need more exploration into the state of kin to sleep. Meanwhile, so I want you to get something here, gang. Before I get out of bed in the morning, every day I nail my Joseph Goddard's. Every single day, no exception. No matter how hard I gotta pee, no matter how bad the kids want to get in the pool, I stay in bed until I nail my 5 to 10, my 6 to 12, and it don't take long. Don't take long because I actually use the state akin to sleep. Naturally. I don't make it a long struggle. <laughs> so when I surrendered to doing a call... I got a cancellation, bringing up 90 minutes of time. I didn't know where the time was going to come from. It came from the most natural place. 
How cool is this? You see, the rational mind is only the interference. In the state akin to sleep, the rational tends to take a break. It tends to do what it's designed to do. It tends to observe a little bit more and control a little less. In the state akin to sleep, it feels like you expand. It feels like you open up. And what's actually happening is you're noticing the expansion, the openness of you. In the state akin to sleep, it seems like you quiet the mind. In the state akin to sleep, you start noticing from the silence that you are, you start noticing the silence that you are. There's so many ways to explore the state akin to sleep instantly, lovingly, and in a way that makes this so incredibly simple. So we've got a live call USA Friday. It's limited to 10 people. I've only shared the link with one person and they dove in. As soon as I share it out, it's going to go. If you want in, drop me an email. 2020 at xhostage.com. I'll send you the details. That's 2020 at xhostage.com. Meanwhile, Neville says not to slight the simple things like the state akin to sleep. People will add in all kinds of complicated things. Diets, breathing, exercise, oils, candles, music, brainwave recordings. And they will skip the importance of the simple. Slow is smooth, smooth is fast, simple equals speedy. If you got gold today... And by the way, I don't know when you're listening to this. If you're listening to it close to when I make the to- make it, you can join in the call. If not, you'll be able to get the call recording later at nevillegoddardstore.com. So, here's what we're going to do. At the end of every every lecture of Neville's that I've heard, he always invites you to go into the silence. What do you think you're doing there? He says, feel a little sleepy. Let's begin there as you go into the silence. My grandma used to sing, slow down, you move too fast, you gotta make the morning last now, kicking down the cobblestones, life is good, I'm feeling groovy, dive deeper, soar higher, have a lovely day, see ya.